The lack of water has caused a conflict between the farmer, the herders, and the wildlife. Poverty levels are rising in the country because we have land but no enough water to irrigate the land, and yet now we don't have enough food to supply to our community. Kenya is a water scarce country. 80% of the country is semi-arid, so the government requires to find out where the sources of water is and also the recharge areas so that they are protected for future use and also for proper management of the waters. What has been built here is a wall. We also have an intake system. So we have two intake systems going different ways, and that is to ensure that we are providing water to two different communities to avoid any conflict in the area. So each community gets an equal share, and as you can see, there's still some water flowing within the river. So that means we've allowed the environmental flow, which is important for people downstream, as well as the wildlife that use, depend on the water. IAEA and FAO are working with scientists in Kenya and all over the world to help farmers adapt to climate change. Nuclear science and technology help increase crop yield, protect water resources, and feed people.